Hello all, Sahana Kumari this side. I hope you all are doing great and fine. Welcome back to my YouTube channel and in today's video I am gonna share how 2022 was for me. So without wasting a moment, let's get started. So 2022 started with really a bad note for me because I had really a very worst argument with one of my client and that has impacted me in a very huge manner that for 9 days that is from January 1 to 9 I was emotionless literally i was emotionless i was neither feeling happy nor sad nor excited nothing i was just emotionless and i realized that i was emotionless uh, the moment when uh, you know i we were having our pre votes and uh, i got 98 percentage but still i was not feeling happy i was not excited i was neither sad nothing i was just you know emotionless then later i had a consultation so i had a meeting with a uh, business and mindset coach then when i uh, had a talk with her then i realized that because of that argument literally i was just emotionless because that has impacted me in a very huge manner and later so after this i started my journey as a social media manager which was uh, really a very good experience and it was a very new journey for me and uh, during this time i had my 12th board exam as well so i managed my time doing both social media managing and as well studies then later you know obviously every student has a uh, anxiety before the day of the result and so do i even uh, i had that anxiety but my anxiety was little different okay it was not the usual anxiety which i used to have before years so why did i have that anxiety is because during my journey okay so i uh, you know receive literally a lot of comments lot of judgment that you will not be able to manage your time or you will you know you will like you just can't you either you will score uh, less marks or you cannot do this work it's just you will you cannot manage time a lot of negativity no support nothing at all so i started my marketing journey my earning journey when i entered my 12th so you know obviously 12th uh, you know in india 12th and 10th are considered the most uh, terrible years that's why even i had gone through that situation and therefore in order to prove all the people wrong that yes you can manage time it is possible my anxiety was into another level what if i you know do not score a very good marks i'll be not able to prove people wrong but uh, you know touch it that did not happen i uh, scored a very good percentage 97.83 percentage then i was like okay i have achieved the biggest dream of my life that you know i proved all the people wrong who told who judged that you cannot manage time so where there is a will yes there is a way so i uh, learned this then later when as i scored a very good percentage i was running for scholarship here here you know everywhere here and there i was running so i would not like to reveal institution name or the person name but when i approached that person for the scholarship that person told me that you have past your 12th in this covid situation so basically you belong to a covid batch so the correction of the paper was liberal and that's why you were able to score 97 percentage and the moment i heard this statement i was like what seriously i worked freaking hard whole damn year and at the end of this I am receiving such comments during the process that during my 12th when I was managing my both work and studies I used to get that you know you will not be able to manage time and though after achieving a bit of success now also I am able to hear such comments and again I learnt a thing that 
वॉट एवर योर सिचुएशन इज दो यू आर वर्किंग हार्ड और दो यू आर सक्सेसफुल देर वुड बी फ्यू सेट ऑफ पीपल हु वुड नेवर स्टॉप सो यू जस्ट डो नॉट केयर अबाउट दो थिंग्स एंड यू नो दैट वॉज अ वेरी सैड मोमेंट फॉर मी बिकॉज लाइक सीरियसली बट या मूविंग ऑन सो लेटर आई जॉइन डिग्री कॉलेज ओके दैट्स गोइंग प्रिटी वेल and i never missed any opportunity in this degree college to showcase my talent i never missed and now i and i i like i am in this year i am respecting all the opportunities which i am getting and thus i did not miss any opportunities to showcase my talent that is public speaking and at the end of the video i'll be showing few glimpses of whatever you know public speaking i did this year so overall in summary this year was like you know i had accomplished my few goals i started my youtube channel and i learned many things you know as i told earlier about my situation how people judge how people are judging you know such kind of things so my biggest learning from this year is do not give up on yourself if i would have give up on myself just by hearing these comments i would never be starting my own youtube channel and be in front of you right so that's why this is my biggest learning that do not ever give up on yourself and never ever change yourself for the sake of the judgment because that is temporary now people might tell you that please become uh, you know fat you are slim they will tell and then you will change yourself then later they'll tell oh this is too much you know just uh, do it vice versa then you will do it again so do not go with this do not just get influenced by these comments because these you know comments are based on temporary situations right that's why do not get influenced and that's all from my end thank you so much for watching and i hope that you have liked it so make sure that you hit the like button comment and subscribe to my channel right now and wishing you a very happy new year may god bless you all with good health and unlimited happiness pure hindustan mein 75 percent log hindi bolna jante hain aur जब फादर ने भी क्वेश्चन पूछा था तो बहुत सारे लोगों ने हाथ खड़ा करा था कि उनकी मातृभाषा हिंदी है तो ऐसे ही पूरे हिंदुस्तान में 40 प्रतिशत लोगों की मातृभाषा हिंदी है Thank you.